Good morning, everyone. It's Sheila here in Boho Daydreams. Welcome to my channel. It's a beautiful, beautiful, sunny Monday morning. And um, if the sun is shining where you're at, give Bob a little thank you. He is the official weatherman here in Boho Daydreams. And his mom says that when he wakes up in the morning, he asks the sun to shine and the sun shines. So we're thankful. I have um, a little happy mail that I've been waiting for for so long. Um, it was a happy mail swap. And I also want to just give you a little peek at the latest um, trim package that is now ready. Um, I had quite a list, again, of um, reserves, but I made extras. Um, so I'm hoping that there's enough for anybody that would like one this time. And I am sorry that it is always so difficult to figure out how to get a hold of one of these because I don't have an Etsy shop. And I know it would be easier for everybody if I did because I would just pop them in there. But they always tend to be a little bit different because I run out of um, trim. So I always have to, um, I have to find something else and add it. And I don't know, it just seems like I can just never really get ahead. Anyway, so this is the package. It is lovely. It's 43 plus pieces again. It has a lot of different pieces. Um, that I haven't used before. It's wrapped up in this turquoise ETL um, strip of fabric and it also contains this beautiful um, embellished piece of very vintage to old um, sari that I that I used to decorate this package. Each of these pieces is different. This one's got a bit of a flower on it some of them have just detailed embroidery and they're heavily gold sequined. Um, so they're all different. They're also all wrapped up in a piece of elephant or elephant peacock trim. And all these are different color too. And I have now run out of these, um, this trim. So I don't know if I will get any more. It's hard to come by. So I, I buy it when I see it. Um, but um, it's not always available. So ho hopefully I can get one more, but I don't know. Um, so these are the pieces. I'm just going to just kind of go through them like this. There's a lot of bling pieces. And this is new. This is, oh, this is so beautiful. And it has a variety of pieces that you can cut up. It's very um, crafter friendly. Um, there's... A silver piece and this will be different in every package um, because um, each package is a little bit unique let's see there's also a lot of pearl pieces a lot of lacy pieces and all these pieces come from India there's nothing in this package that isn't from India it's just so pretty, pretty, pretty. Anyway, that is the package. Again, if you um, would like one of these packages, please email me at scogkill4 gmail.com or find me in the Facebook group Boho Daydreams or the Facebook page Boho Daydreams also. All right. So this is so exciting. This package is a swap. Um, with Shoshi Ben Hamo, and she's in Israel. And Shoshi is a film maker, producer of documentaries, and she documents the history of Israel in the different um, in the different countries of Europe. And so she's always traveling. And when she's not traveling, she's creating these amazing works of art. And we see them every so often in our Facebook group, Boho Daydreams. And we are all just absolutely amazed because I've never seen um, 
the kind of things she can do with threads, fabrics, and lace before. And it's just beautiful. So the package has arrived. Oh, let's see if there's a little note here. It says, Dear Sheila, I was very happy to receive your happy mail from you. This is the opportunity to say thank you very much for the wonderful Facebook group oh, that you manage with sensitivity and great love. It is fun to participate in this group. Thank you for the friendship, and I would be very happy to meet you here in Israel. Sending you some things that I dye with silk color. Some beads, laces. Hope you like the package. Wishing you the best. Thank you for everything. Love, Shoshi. I would love to go to Israel. I have a lot of friends um, in Canada that, that came from Israel. I worked with them in the different healthcare centers. And Israel is very beautiful. I would love to go there. All right. So let's see. Um, ah, look at this beautiful little bag. Oh, it's a beautiful little tapestry bag from Greece. And let's see what's in here. Oh, the beads. Oh, yes. The story of the beads. Oh, she makes amazing beads. Look at these colors. Ah, look at them. So, Shoshi um, had, I, I approached Shoshi if uh, she wanted to do a trade, because I love trading from different countries. And she said, yes, she would love some of the fabrics, especially the fabrics that are sequined, embellished with crystals and whatnot. So I made her a package of those because they're not easy to come by um, in any in any place. So um, she showed me the laces because she knows, knows, knows I love lace. And this lady's got crazy, amazing laces. Um, she showed us her lace patches <laughs> and it's amazing. So anyway, I had asked Shoshi if she would send me a bead because... Um, I had received some beads from Fatima, and I, she, when she found out I was going to hang them off of my little uh, overhead lamps, um, she sent me extras. And so I said, I asked Soshi if she would, Soshi if she would send me a few beads, or even just like two, because I, I was going to hang them. And so this is what she sent me. Look how pretty they are. Look at the colors and the, the bead combinations. Oh, so pretty. Oh, I love them. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, some of her flowers. Oh, these are the ones that she was showing us in the group. And we were all going crazy about them because they're so pretty. Oh, and they are so pretty and they're sent to me. Look at that pretty little fabric. I hope I'm not too close. I can never see what I'm doing. This can't, this this telephone camera here kind of makes me a bit crazy. Oh, they're so pretty. Thank you. They're so lush. Look at that. Oh, they're so lush. All right. Eek. There's one thing I'm absolutely in love with is lace. I love my textiles because I collected them for all the years. And I really, really love them. But there is something about and it gets me in the heart. I have a few other lace packages um, that I have that I need to show you yet. Oh. All right. Oh my goodness. So, um, because Shoshi travels all over to do her documentaries, she goes to their um, consignment shops and their thrift shops. And she finds all sorts of this stuff. So she told me that she would be sending things that came from Austria, Morocco, um, laces from other places. So I said, oh, that's exciting. <laughs> that's exciting. Oh, look at these. These would be her dyed pieces. And when she does dye, when she does her dyeing days, oh my goodness, she has this big, clothesline that just drapes with these pieces and it is so pretty look at 
these tiny little pieces. Oh, they're so pretty. And purples. Oh, my. Those are pretty. Oops, so there's three above the camera. And there's another one. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, yeah. I haven't quite um, mastered the art of dyeing anything yet, except paper. I'm good at that. And if I try and dye my lace like I dye my paper, it never looks very good. Oh, look at all of these pieces. Oh, I just love it. Oh my. Look at these cute little, little doilies. That almost looks tatted. Oh, that's so pretty. Because I can't see what I'm doing, I hope I'm in screen. And if I'm not in screen, please just tell me gently. So I'm excited. I'm working hard to get these, these um, trim packages out because I'm going to Canada. As soon as I have everything out, then I can go to Canada and um, visit my family and spend some time with my granddaughter. I haven't seen her since May. Oh, look at this. Look how pretty is that? Oh, that's so pretty. There's a lot of lace here. Lots of lace. If you can see them all. Some of these are so finely crocheted. They're so bright white and they're soft. Look at that. I don't know which ones come from where because I don't know. But oh, these are so pretty. Oh, they are so pretty. Let's see what's in this little bag. Oh, they're clusters. Oops. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh. That is hand embroidered by this beautiful artist. Look at these, look at the delicate patterns on these fabrics. Oh, those are so pretty. My goodness. All right, I'm just going to lay these out. Oh, look at this like rings attached. Oh, look at the shimmer on this. So pretty. Oh, and there's some buttons. And it looks like some of these buttons are dyed. Oh, those are pretty too. Oh, I, lo I love buttons. <laughs> I'm so happy I found the crafting world because all these things that I loved for so long, I kind of loved by myself because there wasn't anybody else in my world that loved the button box or loved collecting unusual um, fabrics. Not in my world. And then when I started collecting the um, beautiful textiles of India, like the used clothing that were discarded. I had a lot of people think that I had kind of gone a little bit loopy because they couldn't understand my attraction to them. Look at these little, little beads and the little florets. Oh, thank you. Oh, such 
interesting, interesting patterns. I don't have any like these at all. You could just about make a quilt with these, all these squares. Just tie them together. Oh, I love those. I love lace. Oh my goodness, this is beautiful. Look at that. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh my sweet. Oh, it's a trim. It's the trim. Oh, look at this. Is that not beautiful? like all different types of trims beaded together. Wow. Wow. I love this. Thank you so much, Shoshi, for doing a swap with me. I just love this. I love everything that you show us in your group. And then there's a bit of a napkin that's got looks like it's applique on and then some embroidery. I love absolutely everything in this package and I love the beads that you created to send me and the flowers all of these things. Thank you so much for agreeing to a swap with me. I just love it. I hope everybody has an amazing week and I might be back a little bit later with a few other of the um, packages that I received and swapped for this week. Have a good day, and I'll talk to you soon.